converting turn and exit the flight line vertically, showcasing the Super Hornet's turbo nose load capability. are both in the inverted position. From the right, the Blue Angel, double farvel.
Still maintaining minimum separation, the pilots must now align themselves by looking 90 degrees from their flight path towards Captain Kesselring's aircraft. From the, from the right, at 350 miles per hour, the five-plane line abreast flight pass.
Simon is rolling out to demonstrate the awesome power of these General Electric F414 engines. Let's listen as Captain Kesselring calls for the selection of afterburner by the four Diamond pilots. As they pass over center point, you will hear and feel the thunder of eight engines producing 168,000 pounds of thrust. <laughs> Maintaining position as they roll 360 degrees over center point. Yeah. 
Okay. description of our maneuvers as well as an in-depth look at our team and individual biographies we invite you to visit our website and follow us on social media including facebook twitter and instagram to the flight line, approaching the center point. The entire formation will separate in dramatic fashion. Ladies and gentlemen, the Blue Angel Delta Breakout.
Hopefully it will not carry around on this ship at sea. Whether it be a tactical jet, a propeller-driven aircraft, or a helicopter, these require skills that naval aviator must master. In order to go back to this skill, they need very good pilots to have a fit of time to land in the middle of the practice of carrier approaches. In front of the other, Captain Kesselring and his wingman are demonstrating a simulated carrier pattern. Approaching the runway from the right, Captain Kesselring is confirming that the landing checks have been completed and that each aircraft is in fact ready to land. Rolling out on final, they make constant power and line-up corrections, maintaining the optimum rate of descent for the proper touchdown point. As the aircraft taxi back, I would like to take this opportunity to introduce the Blue Angel Maintenance Crew. Command Master Chief Eric McDermott from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Maintenance Master Chief James Fernandez from Long, California. Maintenance Chiefs Adam Wilbur from Louisville, Kentucky. And Jose Bouquet from Medellin, Colombia. Crew Coordinator Carrie Calamus from Ash Flat, Arkansas. Crew Chief Number One David Bloom from Nashville, Tennessee. First back paint shop, Jerry Rumbaugh from Pecos, Texas. Crew chief number two, Taylor Bales from Maryland, New Hampshire. First back back shop, CJ Williams from Dallas, Texas. Crew chief number three, Destiny Berthel from Atlanta, Georgia. First back life support, AJ Acosta from San Angelo, Texas. Crew chief number four, Joseph Knopfsinger from Evendale, Texas. First back airframes, Joshua Boo from Orlando, Virginia. Crew chief number five, Sharon Gatlin from Valdosta, Georgia. First Mech Power Plants, Joshua Watson from Maryville, Tennessee. Crew Chief Number 6, Chief Nero from Wichita, Kansas. First Mech Power Plants, Joseph Domacoy III from San Pedro, California. Crew Chief Number 7, Jordan Walls from Dallas, Texas. Runway Truck Alert Crew, Elliot Moore from Bandera, Texas. Edwin Lalasco from San Miguel, El Salvador. Michael Donaldson from Ripon, California. Tyler Cutts from Dothan, Alabama. And Travis Nolan from Carrollton, Alabama. Quality Assurance Representative Joshua Green from Bear Creek, Alabama. Aerospace Medicine Technician Amelia Hauserman from San Antonio, Texas. Public Affairs Representative Cody Decio from Yakima, Washington. Video Technicians Cam Ferguson from Commerce, Georgia. And Bailey Cole from Granbury, Texas. Logistics Support Representatives Nicholas Orozco from Stockton, California. And Jacques Holder from Riverdale, Maryland. Maintenance Control Representative Freddie Lopez from Torrance, California. Music choreographer Libby Wynn from Rock Hill, South Carolina. C-130 crew Guillermo Hernandez Jimenez from Meridia, Costa Rica, and Russell Frank from Canton, Ohio. Maintenance support personnel Jonathan Kiznowski from Spring Hill, Florida, Michael Sullivan from Dallas, Texas, Eileen Kupka from Linden, New Jersey, and Cody Hendricks from Buford, South Carolina. Ladies and gentlemen, your 2022 Blue Angel Maintenance Crew.
exiting just off to your left, the Blue Angels will momentarily be turning into the parking area. After completing a short maintenance debrief, the team will come to the crowd line where you'll have an opportunity to meet them. As they step away from their aircraft, I would like to take one final opportunity to introduce the demonstration pilots. Thank <laughs> you.